Winter's coming, but Kappa's still here. New Zealanders like this fella here in the video, they know the importance of using the active voice. And you've seen these guys in action, so you know they do as well. The active voice and the passive voice in our writing. That's what the subject is this week. We're looking at various explanations where we've got examples, and in this case, videos that show some of the subtle differences between all of the different uses of the active and passive voice. Several worksheets are available. They're all online quizzes as well. These are really useful for you to practice ahead of time, ahead of your writing as well. There are exercises that are also available to you, so don't be shy and uh, take up some of these uh, exercises on your own. And uh, don't forget that all you got to do to get in the game is to contact Montbrebeuf, click on the Kappa site, and follow the video instructions.